Sean, he got enough confidence for the whole team. We're not worried about his confidence, you know. So, and he's he's good about taking instruction. You know, he's good about trying to do what we want him to do. You know, has it all happened yet? Not yet, but but it's coming, and he's making, like I said, great progress. Well, the first thing is his stride length is considerably less than when he came here, which is a great great advantage as a passer. As I mentioned before, we talked about when your stride's way out there long, your upper body can't catch up to your lower body because that ball is going to come out as close to your front foot. You'd like him to be like in a straight line. He's way out. He's not anymore. He's, he's cut a lot of his stride length out, which should increase his accuracy. He's a lot better than he was in the spring, but he's still not there, guys, and he, he, and he knows it. You know, he, they're so doggone much. You know, and boy, right when he has good practices, you know, and, you're, and then things happen in a game. That's why this one was Monday night is so good for him. That's what we need. Put him, you know, in the real lights, you know, of national television game and see if he can carry these fundamentals that were uh, harping on him over and over and over to the game. He's trying and he's doing better. Has he got it mastered? Not yet. Hugh hadn't held anything back. He's giving it all to him and, and we've been very demanding on him spitting it out properly and, and executing it properly. and. But it's a lot, you know. This kid's bright. I'm gonna tell you, he's smart. All those quarterbacks came out. They loved his brains. I'm looking forward to watching his progression in all these areas we're talking about in these next two games, and uh, we'll see where he is then. David, the fact that these two games are going.